I'm Erica Lopez with your e blog today. We are talking to a local singer and songwriter about her upcoming show this week and a new album. Help me welcome Emily Barnes. Emily, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for having me, Erica. I'm so excited to hear you perform. I got a little sneak peek and you just have a fabulous voice. Tell me a little bit about your background. We were chatting a little bit moments ago. Uh, 15 years old, you got into it. You were kind of inspired by an artist and here you are many years later, you know, writing your own music and performing. Yes, I got a mixtape. We don't have those anymore. <laughs> know, we have right? Spotify playlists, but <laughs> I'm aging myself, but I got a mixtape with Brandy Carlisle on mm -hmm. it. Loved her songs and I started writing my own songs and yeah. hitting the road touring by the time I was 16, 17. Wow. Full time, so that's really cool. Yeah. And obviously, you know, still finding inspiration from things around you. Talk a little bit about, you know, your songwriting and, and what we can expect on your new album. Yeah, so I write songs about life experiences and people I meet. So um, the world right now is obviously a little bit crazy. Yeah. Um, so I have some songs kind of talking about um, welfare and kind of the way that we view people who are struggling a little bit. Yeah. I have uh, women empowerment songs. I'm definitely a true folk singer. Yes. <laughs> um, and just songs about aging and as I transition into a new phase in my life. So yeah. it's kind of got a little something for everyone there. That's wonderful. The, your new album called Mint Condition, you said it took several years to create. So what was that process like? So I really wanted these songs to speak to who I am mm -hmm. now as a person versus when I started songwriting and yeah. kind of get back to my roots. Um, so it just took a little bit longer because I wanted to make sure it was really authentic. I recorded the entire thing myself at wow. home. Um, and it was just such a fun experience to dive back into why I fell in love with music in the first place. Yeah. And it feels very true to myself. So I'm, I'm really proud of it. I'm really excited Congrats, about it. Congrats, you should be. You said yeah. you even played all the instruments yes. as well. Like you, <laughs> she did it all, guys. Yeah. That is so impressive. <laughs> so you have a show, of course, coming up this week on Thursday. Yes. Tell us where we can come out and see you. So I am playing at Ratio Beer Works, the Overland location, okay. not the downtown location. Uh, my friend Calvin Locklear, another local songwriter, hosts a free monthly songwriters round awesome. there. So I'm playing with two other local artists, Renee Moffat, who is on yes! this past week, yes! good friend of mine, and Cameron Hawk. So it's a free show, 7 p.m. Awesome. Uh, ratio, Beer Works in Overland. Okay, and the part that everyone wants now, Emily, take it away for a little performance for us. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> pretending to be something I'm not so I'm not saying yes if what I really mean is no cause I know there's no part of gold at the end of the rainbow nobody wins if everybody's losing job, Emily. Oh my goodness. You're, I absolutely love your voice. Thank you. Thank you again for coming on. I so appreciate you. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. And everyone at home, you can see Emily Barnes this Thursday, April 19th at Ratio Beer Works Overland location. Again, she said that show is free seven o'clock at night. We hope to see y'all there.